Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. This video is about how to transfer files, videos, pictures from your Galaxy A71 or any Galaxy or any Android phone to your laptop. Uh, it's not as simple as just plugging the cable, as you see right here, to your computer, because I have done that. And once you plug it in, obviously, to your phone, into the USB port and you come here and nothing shows up how do you fix that I mean a lot of people on YouTube talk about oh yeah just plug in the cable go in here go to your laptop boom you see the you see your phone as a second or third drive well you don't see anything how do you fix that all right let's do this so go back to your phone. I'm going to go back in. I'm going to just unlock my phone very quick. Go to settings. Scroll all the way down. About phone. <clears throat> Software information. Go to tap on built number multiple times. Pay attention down here. We entered the developer. So I just type in the passcode. That's why I removed it, removed the camera. So you enter the developer mode. This is your developer mode. Because if you go back and you go back one more time, you go at the bottom of the phone, you see you have the developer options. Go in here, it's turned on, activated. You can always turn it off if you don't want to, to have it on. And look for USB debugging. Turn this on. USB debugging is intended for development process only. Turn it on. Again, that's not the case or that's not the, the solution yet. You still have to enable your USB file transfer or video transfer. Uh, I don't know why Samsung did this, why they locked it all down. And uh, because you're supposed to get a message to... Once you plug in your USB cable, like, you know, if you want to charge your phone, you want to transfer data, what do you want to do? So we're looking for to get those options. That's the key. So we're looking for USB. Debug USB configuration. You got to go in here. And now you have your options. Again, this is the first time you initialize you activate the settings I'm going to go to transfer files or images whichever you want I'm just going to go transferring images because that's what the key is that's what I, I'm trying to do I'm going to try to transfer files video files pictures you go back you go back even if I unplug my USB and I plug it back in. I don't get any messages. Still don't get anything. I don't get anything on my on my screen either. So let's restart. By restart, I mean restart your phone. Most Android phones, older generations, you plug in the USB, that option comes up. Transferring files, folders, pictures, images, videos. I don't know why it's been locked. Uh, but uh, here we go. It's restarting. Coming up, almost there. Uh, 
All right. Type in my password to get in. There we go. Phone is starting. So everything is loading. Uh, going back to settings again, just to confirm developer options is active. You can always go back in here and turn it off, but we want to make sure we can connect. Unplug USB. Plug it back in. Here we go. So after restarting the phone, as you can see, now we have the option. USB for image transfer. Tap on this. Uh, you can choose transferring images or files. Android's audio. So, and also you will see it on your phone now. This is the one. And you know, on the Windows PC, you basically just open up any, you open a file explorer, you come here, it should, it will appear after just a few seconds.